the Elkhorn Mountains are all part of a set of volcanic islands and arcs. And they crashed into North America and become the place where Oregon began. The rest was the ocean. Idaho was the beach. When it comes to Oregon's ancient beginnings, Ellen Morris Bishop is one of the best time travelers around. So we're going to go up here and look at a greenstone. Looking at this rock, it has little white crystals in it, and that's a mineral called plagioclase. And it tells us that this came from an island arc. So for a 280 million year old rock, this tells quite a story. Our next stop takes us deeper into Hell's Canyon to see some more rocks. So this is a Triassic limestone. And these rocks were deposited during a time when the dinosaurs were just appearing. Cute little things that would have been running around about the size of chickens. <laughs> these micas are a diagnostic clue that this is a high pressure, high temperature rock where one thing smashed into another. Traveling up the Salmon River Canyon takes us right into the zone where the two land masses sutured together. Here, the heat and pressures rise to the point of creating actual gemstones. 